it is Keisha. I miss you guys so, so, so much. Today, I am going to be removing my makeup using the Ultrasonic Advanced Cleansing System. I have been using this to clean my face, but this is my first time actually taking off my makeup with it. So, let's just see how it fares for this process. So, I am using coconut oil to go ahead and remove my makeup. It's more cost effective and natural way than makeup removal wipes. Now, we have the Ultrasonic brush in all its glory it is re retails for 40 54 dollars but i did get it on sale for 35 dollars so it was a steal it does have three settings it has a gentle cleansing setting a daily cleansing setting and deep cleansing is step three it's the pulsating one i really like that for the fact that it's not just a set um just one setting it's three settings so i really do like that so ultrasonic brush it is for all skin types water resistant coreless rechargeable it has high frequency cleansing and exfoliation and it helps to improve skin texture removes dulling build up to reveal cleaner clear skin improve skin's ability to absorb skin care treatments I am using the silicone brush head. It does come with three. I am using the silicone one just to remove the makeup. I feel like it is more, it's just more hygienic to use it for this purpose. It is pore clarifying and termicrobial silicone pad. It's for all skin types, but I just really like the fact that it's not cloth or has the bristles as the other brushes. So, yes, now I put on my facial cleanser. I forgot to actually wash my face between each brush and application. My apologies. But anyway, I am using the sensitive brush head now. And it is a longer bristle head. It has very soft microfibers. And it just helps with cleansing, daily cleansing I like to use it for. So I am just showing you how you attach them. It's like three hooks. It's very easy peasy. It takes nothing more than a second. Anyway, so I am using the sensitive. Even though it's sensitive, I use it for the daily, actually daily use. Because you only get three brush heads. The silicone, which I use for the makeup. The sensitive, which I use for daily cleansing. And then the normal one is more so helps with exfoli exfoliating. So I just use that as my exfoliator brush head. So anyway, I just do the same steps as I did with the silicone. I really like this brush head. It's very soft. I do have it on setting two, which is the daily cleansing setting. And I really like this. And the only thing I will say is it does shed a little bit. Like you get one or two hairs after you actually use this brush head. But nothing too crazy actually. It's still a pretty good product. I like the fact that I am in control in the, the movements, circular movements. So yes, do you see that? A hot mess <laughs> of products. But now as you can see, my face looks relatively clean and it is clean. Like it doesn't really have any makeup left on there. I wish I was able to take it off, wash my face to really see how effective it was with just the silicone. But my apologies, I have just been losing my mind and I just didn't do it. But anyway, we are going to start using the exfoliator, which is the normal brush head. It exfoliates and cleans deep cleansing bristles. It is more densely packed than the sensitive one. And I do use setting one for this for gentle cleansing because I feel like the brush does have a lot of kick to it it doesn't hurt it doesn't make me uncomfortable it doesn't create redness as you can see it's just it holds a punch i will say that so i like to keep it on setting one i never really use the setting three which is the deep cleansing which is the pulsating one but i don't think i really have a need for it anyway I just really like this sonic brush i feel like it is um good value of money I also feel as if um, I like the fact that it, it vibrates 
more so than spins in a circle and I'm able to control my circular movements instead of anyone else being able to control them. Right now I am using a moisturizer just to put moisture back in my face as well as putting vitamin E oils to just seal up my moisture. I like the coconut and vitamin E, but I do not have any holy grails besides those two. So if guys, if you have any recommendations, just please let me know. Thank you for watching. And all in all, I really like it. I really think it is worth the money. So until later, bye.